here is the duck family while Mike is calling the lock. We are headed into lock two, so our second lock, and it's actually the start of a series of five locks that take us up about 35 feet each one. And it takes an hour and a half to go through all five, so if we can get in on this one, it's gonna be a busy run through this morning. So that will be an interesting set of five locks. And really what it's doing is taking us up to the Mohawk River. So we're kind of heading up this way and heading up to the Mohawk River. So here's all the boats in Waterford. One boat so far waiting in line for the lock. And it's actually a farmer's market over there. They're setting up for, so we checked it out briefly. But now we are gonna get going while we can. Lock E2, Waterford, New York. Welcome, says. Locking procedures, entering, reducing speed, mooring lines required, vendors required. Exiting after gates open, cast off, exit slowly. See, here's somebody at the gate. There's somebody up here. Okay, we are in lock number two. Haley, helping me out up here. My hand is disgusting. Just gonna say. There I thought this was a cable I could tie a rope to, but apparently it's not. I just have to grab onto this nasty thing. I would advise anybody coming to this to bring gloves. That is my Erie Canal advice. Bring gloves that you don't care about after. Mike says his boat gloves. If you use them for anchoring and this kind of thing, get all nasty, which is not surprising because my hand is disgusting. So here we are, one other boat, just the two of us. Getting ready to make the five locks this morning. Okay, we've left this lock behind. The, their doors are closing and now we are in canal country. Look at this little side area here. So yeah, this is... an interesting place to live, eh? Yeah, look at this, right along the water here. So yeah, we're following this boat. It looks like we're going to be side by side the whole way. And uh, we've got to do a port side tie at lock number five and otherwise it's pretty straight going it seems like but yes here we are this yeah, now be a little more careful on our angle in lock five for that mass. yes exactly we really don't want to be bumping that again today. exactly i agree but yes we, this definitely feels a lot more like a canal now eh yes oh wow the other lock is right up ahead yeah take much. Okie dokie. So we're just off to lock number three. I can see this is what our day is going to be all about. <laughs> That's actually like the locks have been ready. We're good. We're timed well. We just hopped right off the lines and got right in. So, so far anyway, it hasn't been a lot of waiting around. We are entering lock three. Looks like it's the same setup as before. So I'll get ready to tie up. Okay, so one thing about the Erie Canal is they're all, so far, the locks different. And this one is back to a random giant cable, unlike the last one which had random ropes. So you kind of don't know what you're going to get until you get in there and then you've just got to adapt and tie up. So that's the thing. This is uh, what we're doing. So now we're tying by the middle, sort of. Successful completion of lock three. I won't go that far yet. Okay, it's not completed yet. Oh, I mean we're at our but we're at the top. And look at these lines that we were expecting that didn't appear. They apparently are all here. They just haven't been kicked down. So it would have been nice if somebody did that as they opened the lock. You would think that would be part of the opening the lock routine? It's like McDonald's. you got to do things a certain way. <laughs> I don't think this is much like McDonald's. <laughs> yeah, you're probably right. Anyway, that was um, less uh, enjoyable. Yeah, that was less enjoyable. 
given the state of, we tied in the middle this time, and it felt like the fender was getting pulled down. I certainly can. That's what I'm here for, Captain. Okay, similar to last time, we finished lock three, and here comes lock four. So we are on our way in. Hopefully this time there will be lines down.
let's share and play properly, everybody.